Well, as an actress, Jasmine Simon knows how to transform into another person, but in real life, she knows how important it is to be your authentic self. Now she's inspiring the next generation in her new children's book, Most Perfect You, and Jasmine is here now. Welcome, Jasmine. Thank you so much for having me today. I have to say, you know, we were just talking before this, and I was saying a lot of children's books out there, but this is really a wonderful book. Thank you. You know, tell us a little bit about Irie and what she's going through in this story. Irie is a little girl, and it's a warm July day, and she comes downstairs, and she hates her hair. Yeah. Her hair is too poofy, and she wants her hair to be like everybody else. So she asks her mom, can she wear a really hot wool hat? And her mom's like, you could, but why do you want to yeah. wear it? And we realize that Irie doesn't like herself. And so her mom's going to take her on a journey of self-discovery to realize that every single thing about herself is absolutely, specially and specifically made. I call it perfect. Yeah, I love it too. And it also you know, encourages you to ask questions when your kids say they don't like something. You know what I mean? That is a very good point. So yeah. the mom could have been like, yeah, you can wear it. But the, she, she needed to ask, why don't why? you want to wear it? It's a reminder that our children are just little people. Yeah. And sometimes they don't know how, how to, to start the themselves. conversation. Yeah. So we need to help them along in some ways. Yeah, take that extra second. But I know that the Irie is inspired by your own daughter who's here today, which yes! is no longer a little Irie. Um, but did you have this conversation with her when she was young? Was this inspired by her? It was inspired by a conversation that I had with her when she was three years old. I was in the car, me and my very best friend, and she was in the back seat and she said, Mama, I want to be pretty. My skin needs to be light. Oh. And in that oh, second... That's heartbreaking. Oh, it was heartbreaking. Uh. In that second, I thought, now how do I fix this? Yeah. And I said, you know, Kennedy, when you were in my belly, I had a conversation with God and I told him that I wanted you to have my favorite color of skin and that's why your skin is brown. So I I don't know, not only do I think it's beautiful, I think it's perfect. Yeah. And every single thing about you, I got to hand pick. And three year old yes. Kennedy Irie sat in the back seat and she said, Okay. And she never asked about it again. Oh my God, what a wonderful story. Yes. And so now, 14 years later, here we are. It and was a long time in the making, this book. It was. You know, <laughs> yeah. it was the summer of 2020, and it was a lot of pain going on in the world. Yeah. It was the global pandemic. People were dying. And I had a one year old at the time, and, a, and she was 15 at the time. And over and over on repeat, we saw George Floyd being murdered on yeah. television. Yeah. And I thought, oh my gosh, this is what children are seeing. Right. We need them to see something we need positive. them to see love and yeah. light and so I decided to write this book so so the reflection that they see is internal and in, yeah it's not on the outside it's that you're perfect on the inside exactly the way that you are and also don't compare yourself to anybody else this what, what's the reaction been from parents who have read the book because you know you know what my reaction was I yes. love it you know, the book just came out today, so please, by all means, go pick it up. But the people that we were able to send copies to have loved it. And not only the children, but the mothers have yes, loved it. Yes. They said, this is the book that I needed when I was a kid and the book that I need now. Yeah. This is a reminder that I, too, am Imperfect. perfect. Yeah, yes. I totally agree. Um, you know, and I feel like, you know, you mentioned you had a two-year-old son. Irie is 17 <laughs> now. Do you feel like it's harder to be your authentic self and be confident with social media these days? Because I do. Of course you do. Yeah. You know, the mech gala was last night it was beautiful everyone looked fantastic so today there will be a 10 year old girl and a 40 year old woman yes. that will look at Instagram and say oh my gosh this is who I want to be yeah. but what they don't realize is the work that went into that right and so we're, we're parenting and that's not real life that's, that's not a real. moment it's a photograph and there are more important things about there for you to be your most perfect you yes. and most perfect you <laughs> is out everywhere now so check it out Jasmine thank you so much